in this question we have to prove that cos of tan inverse sin cot inverse x is equal to root over x square plus 1 divided by x square plus 2. Now let us solve this question. Now left hand side is equal to cos of tan inverse sine of cot inverse x. Now cot inverse x is equal to sin inverse root over 1 by 1 plus x square. Therefore, sin of cot inverse x is equal to sin of sin inverse over by 1 plus x square. So this is equal to root over 1 by 1 plus x square. Right? Therefore, left hand side is equal to cos of tan inverse root over 1 by 1 plus x square. Now tan inverse root over 1 by 1 plus x square is equal to cos inverse root over 1 by 1 plus 1 by 1 plus x square. So this is equal to cos inverse root over x square plus 1 divided by x square plus 2. Therefore, cos of tan inverse root over 1 by 1 plus x square is equal to cos of cos inverse root over x square plus 1 divided by x square plus 2. So this is equal to root over x square plus 1 divided by x square plus 2. Therefore, left hand side is equal to root over x square plus 1 divided by x square plus 2 is equal to right hand side. Therefore, what we get is cos of tan inverse of sine of cot inverse x is equal to now here it comes root over x square plus 1 divided by x square plus 2. Hence proved. So basically in this question we have used the relation between cot and sine tan and cos etc. This is a simple question on inverse trigonometric function 
but one erroneous approach can lead you to some problem. Don't assume x to be equal to cot theta because there is a common tendency for people to assume that x is equal to cot theta. But in this approach you can misguide and sometimes can create real difficulty because in any way this substitution is not going to help because if x is cot theta in the next step you get sin theta. So you have to co convert sin theta in terms of tan theta. So basically again you have to substitute x and so this approach is not going to help and so you have to just approach directly in this method writing cos inverse and times of sin inverse as we are seeing sin just before cot inverse as sin in of sin of sin inverse a is equal to a therefore we apply it here so in the next step we get tan inverse of root over 1 by 1 plus x square which convert into cos inverse and then it ultimately converts into root over x square plus 1 by x square plus 2 and hence the question is proved.